this video we're showing you how to create split billing invoices. Click on invoices, drafts, click on new draft invoices. So you can choose to specify the clients or you can keep it as all clients, all matters, my matters or responsible timekeeper. Then we have the billing category if you have some billing category set up. And then we have a date range. I'm going to leave this first one empty to leave it open-ended. And then we have the invoice date defaulted to today. And I'm going to go ahead and include just the time. And I'm going to select this split checkbox. Now, we generally recommend you don't split the entries in the first draft. That is to say to review the draft first, make any edits if necessary to the time or expense entries and then avoid the draft invoice and issue it again with the split checkbox selected. The reason being is that you want to make sure that all the entry details are accurate as it's a little bit more difficult to reverse the whole split entry process after you've split the bill. So I'm going to go ahead for this demo purpose and I'm going to do the split right now. I'm going to hit create and then you can see here we have these two split entries and this plus sign means that they have been split. 